Um, spring break is in full effect. Jabe's, they're expecting the largest crowds ever this year. Are you shocked? Are you shocked? Yeah. Um, about everyone just coming back like in a crazy way? Y- yeah. Also, like, yeah. who who's expecting this? Yeah. Right. So like, what, what location? Right. So I'm gonna go through the locations. You ready? Because okay. these are some of my faves. Here, yeah. Some of my faves. Okay. Panama City. Because uh, they canceled Panama City like three, four years ago. Where sure they did. Just, they got rid of like drinking on the beach. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, sure did. They're coming back. Huh? Doesn't it? Doesn't matter. So here's on spring break. Oh yeah, yeah, matter. yeah. No, because uh, here, here's what's gonna happen. The kids are ready to fucking rage. Um, the article I read this morning just said, look, if you really think about it, the last two years for college students, they've been on Zoom or they've been at their parents' house, which, you know, our, our best friends, our neighbors next door, their kids are all in college and they were living there just right. doing classes on the fucking couch. Is it safe to kind of say that Florida didn't really ever well, they never. Down, they, they, did, they did shut down some of the beaches for a while mm-hmm. at some point. So this is the first year without mask where you can go. Um, and enjoy yourself and, and not really give a fuck about anything. And then I just read uh, maybe about 30 minutes ago uh, that TSA is going to stop making wear masks on planes April 18th. Really? Yeah. I thought that was going to hold on for a long time. I did time. too, and I'm curious to see if they push it or move it or whatever. You know, if this is one of those like, oh, hey, we'll give them a little nugget and then we'll take it away from them. They don't deserve it. We have to, we have to control them. And I don't know. This was uh, pre-pandemic, though, that Panama City banned drinking from the beaches uh, five years ago. Yeah. So, still yeah. banned. Still banned. Uh, actually, the still banned. P- PCB posted, about, posted this about a month ago. The police department did. Mm-hmm. By the way, I found this on a website called mypanhandle.com. Yeah, so, uh, big fan of that. So, big fan of that. That's interesting. I'm uh, going to be on it every day. Now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, what a byline yeah, yeah, yeah. to have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah so PCB beach government, uh, or PCB government, um, no possession or consumption of alcohol on the sandy beach. Yep. No possession or consumption of alcohol in commercial parking lots. Mm-hmm. Uh, booze sales end at 2 a.m. No open house parties. That's the other big one. The rest of these so are just what are kinda, you going to do? Yeah, this like single-handedly killed Panama City as a destination for like a while. Yeah, do? yeah. D- doesn't matter. All you're doing is putting it in cops now, and that's kind of it. Because we had this at Carolina Beach. And I remember we were shooting uh, Zimas and Jollies, the uh, music video, you and I. Mm-hmm. Um, and I was drinking Zemo just straight out of the bottle on the beach and, and they came up and gave me a little slap on the dong and they were like, Hey, you can't have glass, glass alcohol on the beach, right? right. You can't have any form of it uh, right. on the beach. And I was like, all right, cool. What's the fine for something like that? Yeah. They were like, Ugh, it's going to be like $150 yeah, it's deep. And I go, awesome. I got, I go, I got about six more of these to drink. So if you just want to tally me up for all six, I'll just write you a check now. And the guy was like, what? You don't care? Yeah. And I was like, no, no, no. I don't care. And I'm a grown-up. Okay? And that's when you got the gun pulled on you. I'm an adult. You know. No, we kept shooting. Everything. The show goes on. Okay? Yeah. yeah. I'm not fucking leaving. So show went on. We did the whole thing. It's exactly what's going to happen in all these spring break places and dry campuses and all this bullshit. Like, it doesn't fucking matter. Kids are going to rage. People are fucking getting their dicks wet. Um, maybe tits wet too. I don't know, but they're invading and there's nothing you can do about it. There's nothing you can do. What do you think? The cops are going to, the defund the police cops are going to be like, man, you know what I should really do is go Try walk out on this arrest every single one of and these go people. walk out on a hot ass Sandy beach, full uniform. And try to arrest these kids. You're not going to do shit. This is this was always like our peak content back in the Grand X days. Oh yeah, CFM dude. Days because like yeah, there was plenty of cop chasing videos. On the oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, also yeah, yeah, yeah. they love to do it because yeah. this is how the cops personally undefund themselves. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By yeah. writing tickets, tickets. constantly. Yeah, also, yeah, yeah this true. Panama City, like they're literally only there for three weeks. Yeah. And then What's, the rest, no. you ever been to Panama City other than the three weeks of spring no. break? No. There's no one there. It's a ghost town. Been. It's depressing as fuck. Yeah. Um, uh, and, and same with Destin. Um, I used to feel that way about Daytona as well. Uh, probably still do. Probably still do. So probably still hold a little bias there. I mean, there's a Hooters across from the airport, which is lovely. And they got the Daytona 500, but that's about it. You're kind of, eh, you know? That was the spot where you could drive on the beach back in the day in the 80s. Like, you see those old grainy videos on, like, vintage frat and shit like that? They're driving on the beach partying, yeah. drinking. God damn it, dude. 
Drinking yeah. and driving again, you know? Yeah. Son of a bitch. Doing cocaine off the Trans Am, the top of the Trans Am. You're like, fuck, man. Right. I miss that shit. I wasn't touching, a part of it. Touching titties. Right? Touching titties, dude. Semi-consensual sex. <sighs> Semi? Well, it's not. It's not real. I mean, No, yeah. it's not our word. I have another jello shot. Oh, you need to use but my bathroom? But the next day, you definitely regret it. So yeah. it's kind of like a... Mm-hmm. And the, be- the best, too, was like you. all these hotels at these spring break destinations have wristbands. So you can't go to other people's hotels without sneaking in without the wristband. 100%. So you have to like, I remember yep. my own days oh, going yeah, to Panama we had City. To yeah. We had to climb walls and like go over moats and stuff to just to get into my friend's like hotel. And that was the part of the fun of it of like, man, can I sneak in there? Right. Are they going to catch me? Are they going to fucking know, dude? I got to get over that wall, brother. Why? I don't know. I don't. I can't remember her name, but I've got to get over that wall right now. And it's like, all right, cool. And then, boom, you split off. Security guard chases one guy. You get to go to your your destination. And then, boom, you wrap up with your friends, and then do it again for somebody else's hotel. And that was part of the fun of it. Eight hundred bracelets all the way down your arm for different hotels mm-hmm. that you've collected throughout the week. Fucking zinc oxide, dude. I want some green zinc oxide all over my face. We're gonna do that though when I take Giorgio to uh, Coachella this year. So. For your rebirth? Um, for my rebirth, yeah. And divorce, yeah. yeah. Well, I'm just I'm just getting reborn. I'm not saying I want a divorce. You don't have to say you want a divorce. <laughs> I can serve you while you're gone. Jesse, two yeah. Rosses. <laughs> two Rosses. The new Ross yeah. and the old Ross. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. We're lucky I'm alive, Jabes. Let's celebrate life. Let me celebrate life, you know? We're lucky <clears throat> you're alive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like Craig said. If I would have died, there wouldn't have been this amazing seltzer out in the world and people wouldn't be getting fucked up at 10 a.m. But here we are, dude. But here we are. Because of me, the big guy. Yeah. The big guy did all this. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I want to come out of that vagina. I want to be reborn again. Kanye. Billie Eilish. You know, there's a lot going on there. Sure. Swedish house mafia. I just want to see Giorgio and how many drugs he would possibly be on for Swedish house mafia playing for the first time in, what, seven years? Oh, God. No, he just get a job there. No, <laughs> like no. someone like will just some, hand him a camera. Yeah, some kind of behind the scenes thing. He literally cannot just go and watch it, right? You think he'd work it? He has to be working it. Yeah, no. He can't go. He Stop can't calling go. me out like that, James. <laughs> because I know, because I feel the same way. You'd be like, uh, let me get something in my hand. Like this feels weird. I'm just at Swedish House Mafia, fucked up. I mean, nothing to do. Maybe with like a nice lady friend and some Molly. Yeah. How much easier is it to get the lady friend with a camera in your hand? And Molly. So if you <laughs> if you bring Molly and say, "Hey, I've got unlimited Molly," it'll they be can a choose swarm. from anyone, especially Coachella. You're looking for the people that can get you backstage or yeah. to VIP or whatever. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So they're going to be scoping someone out that looks like they are connected in some way. Yeah. To I took an oath when we started this job not to use our powers for evil. Well, is Giorgio, it evil? It's, is it evil? It's not evil. No, you're just you're just showing people uh, what they look like through a very nice camera lens, and then yeah. you're handing them drugs that are illegal, and just saying, "Hey, join me. We're just gonna dance for a little bit, maybe make out, and I'm gonna smoke some menthol cigarettes." I do want a menthol right now. Who doesn't? Right. God damn Lord, it, dude. Tell me about it. God damn it. I want to go back to spring break. Two packs a day. Marlboro Lights. Uh, a crush. Drink I'll get, of. I'll get a crush. Hypnotic in a blue Gatorade bottle. Oh, oh let's there go. There we go. Let's go. Add a little Hennessy, make it a green one. Yeah, right? dude. Let's yeah. go. The Incredible Hulk, I believe that yes. is called. Yes, it God is. damn right yes, it is. It is. Yes, Hammer it the is. like button on YouTube right now, okay? Okay? <laughs> Hammer the like button for Giorgio today. Yeah. He's yeah. bringing up Incredible Hulks. God damn it, man. I can feel the sun all over my body, and I can feel those first two sips go down. The first two are hard. The rest of that bottle is easy, dude. The first two sips are a street fight, though. What's another location? I mean, we're still on Panama City. So you got Panama City. Mm -hmm. uh, Fort Lauderdale is going to be rocking. People go to Padre. Let's go Padre down here. That's in Texas. Um, Texas is fucking open. The Quan, Cancun, uh, is open Mm -hmm. for biz. Okay. Um, and then a lot of people go to Tulum. What's with the Tulum thing? That's, that's new. That's recent. That's it's recent. Like Playa. It's more Playa than Tulum. Okay, that that one's a new one. That one's a recent one. Tulum is also just around the corner from Cancun. 
Is yeah. it really? Yeah, it's but right next to it. But what's the one that they're going to that's like lesser known Cancun that's right by Tulum? Playa something. Playa del Carmen? Playa del Carmen. So uh, on the Yucatan Peninsula, it goes Cancun, Playa del Carmen, Tulum. Like right. All right next to each other. Right. And so if you want to like consider yourself like not Cancun material, although Playa del Carmen is just going to be Cancun, only you feel like it's nicer yeah or more exclusive or something sure. it's all the same mm-hmm. but yeah um it really is isn't it god damn it man i want in i i was never the one on spring break who wanted to go see the fucking ruins by the way like i'm good it was ruined for a reason tulum is pretty sweet only because it's like in the water okay but yeah all right uh, look i'm down for tulum i just don't want to walk around the ruins probably wouldn't even leave the fucking hotel you know right right um, but either way, I feel like uh, once March Mad, once March Madness starts, and then uh, St. Patrick's Day kicks in, then it's it's like all right, great, it's going to be eighty next week. And then it's like let's take the shirt off, let's do a couple key bumps just to stay alive, just to feel like we're alive again.